All right, look, can you guys stand together? That's a bit intimidating, that. What are you doing? Even though you are ladies. What are you doing? I get a bit paranoid when you split up and circle me. What are you doing? Sorry, guys, can you identify yourself? What are you doing? Please? Could you identify yourself, please? Can you identify yourself for me? Not, not unless I know I'm speaking to a police officer. I am a police officer. Could you identify yourself, please? please. No name. Can we help you with anything? No. Can I have your name then, please? No. Are you, you going to clear you? off for us then? Pardon? Are you going to clear off? Clear off? Yeah. How dare you speak to a member at public like that? What are you doing? How dare you speak to me like that when I... What are you doing? I'm sorry, but I'm a taxpayer. I'm a citizen. Uh, can we just, we just need to can we just, why you're here? Can we just bring it down a little bit, please? Can we just bring can it down a little... Well, I don't wish to engage with people who tell me to click. Can you clear off? No. No, well, that's the same answer to you. We've it's quite been, rude, we've that. Been sent out to ask why you're here. Okay, yeah. You seem to be filming or something, yeah. and I'm asking, is there anything that I can help you with? I'm reporting on uh, PC Ryan Waller. Right. Yeah, he stole £65 from a dead person. And that's he, why you're here? He works at Humberside Police, so I'm covering a story right. on why a Humberside Police officer thought it was clever to steal £65 out of a dead man's wallet. Right. Have you got any comments? Yeah, no. no. Comments. Have you got any comments? No comments. No. Do you think it's acceptable to take sixty-five pound out of a dead person's I'm, wallet? I've got no comments. The main concern is why you're here, and we're asking you to leave now, please. Um, is this not a public area? We're asking you to leave now. You seem to be filming is vehicles that... coming in and out, which is not. I'm very... not. I'm literally covering all this area. Yeah. yeah we've I'm got give... all vehicles coming in and out. People. And I'm not allowed to do that. They're not happy that they're getting the vehicles filmed. But I'm not... out. let's just stick with what what's within the lo boundaries of the law. And not what people don't like. Uh, do I, I'm a requested to by law. Yes. We need to know why you're here. Okay. With that, and if there's anything I can help you with, and, I've and what law states? And I've asked you for your details. And what law states that I've got to give my details? Listen, we just want to know what you're doing. I've told you what I'm doing. I'm repa yeah, reporting on why PC. Do you need to stand here? Pardon? Why do you need to stand here? Because I take a visual of the police station as I'm telling my story on these corrupt officers. Yeah. How long do you plan on being here for? Uh, as long as the story takes to cover and then I usually clear off, as you said, but quite rudely. But yeah, I do my story and it's it's not against you guys, oh. right? Because nobody hates a corrupt officer more than an officer, right? So it's not against you guys, but I don't appreciate you guys coming out here, telling me to clear off and you demanding me to give you me details and but telling me that... I need to know why you're filming and you've And I've told you exactly... I've told you exactly why I'm filming. Can you tell me what article... Can you turn your camera the other way then so that you're not filming these cars coming in and um, out? I'm sorry, but it's...